Data creation and collection increases on a daily basis. People need to be more effective collaborating on this information and organizations need better ways to manage it. In this video, I will discuss and demonstrate IBM Lotus Quicker and how it can integrate with enterprise content management systems such as IBM FileNet and IBM Content Manager. Lotus Quicker is IBM's team collaboration and content sharing software. It has a rich set of features such as content libraries to share information, team discussion forums to encourage communication, wikis that let your team create and edit content together, and connectors that help make sharing easier with other software such as Lotus Notes, Lotus Connections, Lotus Same Time, Lotus Symphony, Microsoft Office, and Microsoft Outlook. Lotus Quicker also provides an intuitive front end to enterprise content management systems right out of the box and can be extended with a variety of business partner solutions. Let's take a look at Lotus Quicker. First of all, we make it easy to get started by providing a set of pre-built templates to allow you to quickly create your team place. Once your team place is created, you go to your homepage. And here I can show you that we also provide integration with Lotus Connections and Lotus Same Time in order to collaborate with your team members. Now, once we open up a particular team space, I can show you how easy it is to customize the, the pre-built template. For example, what you have here is the ability to add a set of pre-built uh, widgets that you can sim simply select, or you can create new pages and add team members directly from here. And once a page has been created, we even allow you to customize the look and feel by simply dragging and dropping the different um, widgets that are on a page. Now, we also have provide capabilities for a team calendar, as well as uh, a wiki and blogs, so that you can easier collaborate with other team members. We also have the ability for content sharing. In fact, we make it very easy to, to uh, share your content. You can simply drag and drop documents to a little place here on the web page, and that will automatically upload the document into the team uh, repository. Once the document has been uploaded, we can simply go in now and view some of the capabilities. Here you can check in, check out, edit a document, or even edit the custom metadata. Here I've created a property page where I have uh, provide the capability of changing the importance of a document. And again, this is all customizable within the web user interface. Enterprise content management solutions deliver critical capabilities for managing content and support consistency in classifying and categorizing information. They help to maintain revisions, enable users to find information, and enforce compliance and records management rules. The IBM FileNet P8 platform combines powerful document management with ready-to-use workflow and process capabilities to automate and drive your content-related tasks and activities. IBM Content Manager manages all types of content, such as images, office documents, XML data, audio and video, with support for a breadth of platforms, databases, and applications. This combination provides an agile enterprise content management environment that can help organizations solve complex problems and make better decisions faster in today's rapidly changing business environment. Integrating Lotus Quicker with IBM ECM solutions allows you to display ECM content in Lotus Quicker transfer content from Lotus Quicker to your ECM environment. And with the Lotus Quicker connectors, you can directly interact with your ECM content. Let's take a look at how we've integrated Lotus Quicker with an enterprise content management system. In this case, uh, IBM FileNet P8. First of all, we make it very easy for you to, to um, transfer files from your Quicker environment into the enterprise content repository. Simply select the document and bring up the context menu. Here we can say publish to an external location. Once we've published to an external location, you can see that we bring up a list of uh, directories on the enterprise content management system that we can select from. In this particular case, we'll select a, a directory. And what happens up next is, a, is a, um, uh, a notification from the FileNet system that we have to add some extra metadata. If we remember earlier in our um, demonstration of Lotus Quicker, we, we talked about how we could create custom metadata. Well, in fact, if the metadata matches between the two systems, then we'll automatically pre-fill in that information when the dialog box comes up from FileNet. In this case, what we're going to do is just add some additional information that FileNet is asking for. 
simply fill in the blanks and then select next. Now we're given the option of choosing whether or not we want to uh, transfer and just save a link of this document inside of Quicker, whether we want to copy the document, or whether we want to just move it and delete it out of Quicker. In this particular case, what I'm going to do is select uh, make, a, make, a, make a copy or a link. Now what I'm going to do here is select finish, and you'll see here that in fact we get a notification that that process has started to moving the document over to our FileNet repository. Now, in fact, if I bring up my FileNet user interface and I hit refresh, you can see now that the fact that the document has, in fact, been transferred over to our FileNet repository. It's really that simple. Now, on top of that, um, because this is run, we've put this document inside of FileNet, we've also created a business process that automatically gets invoked whenever a new document is moved into the repository. In this particular case, I'll just hit refresh, and you can see now that this document workflow process has in fact been created. In fact, I can actually track the workflow inside of the, inside of the FileNet UI. And you can see here that the steps that have already automatically taken place within the workflow. This particular workflow is, is, in a, document, is a document approval workflow where we want this particular document to be managed by the records manager function inside of FileNet. With the records management function of FileNet, we can, we can put all the necessary organizational or regulatory requirements on a document. For example, retention, retention length times and those sorts of things. And again, as the different workflow processes continue, this workflow will automatically be updated. Now, on, on top of the capabilities of being able to move the documents from Quicker and into our Enterprise Content Management Repository, we also have the capabilities of accessing that content directly from our environment using the Lotus Quicker connectors. The Lotus Quicker connectors provides the capability of accessing documents, whether they're in the Quicker repository or, the, or any of your enterprise content management repositories, directly from your Windows desktop. So here I just bring up my Windows Explorer and I have now access to those folders directly within my Quicker repository. And in fact, I even have access to the folders within my FileNet repositories as well. So in fact, if I select my FileNet repository, you can see the documents that, that are there and the one that I just added. And again, if I want to edit a document right from that repository, I can simply double click on it and it'll automatically bring up the appropriate editor. Now here, I'd like to also show you how the Lotus Quicker connectors can also integrate into Office environments. So you can see directly from my word processor here where I can update a document, check a document, check for different versions of a document. I can even go ahead and modify that custom metadata directly from within my Office environment. And this also works the same whether you're using Microsoft Office or Lotus Symphony. Now, I can also publish that and check that out directly from here. Now, we also provide um, other capabilities. You can directly open a document from a quicker repository just by selecting the appropriate menu item. Now we also provide an interface into our quicker repositories, both the ones that are built into quicker and the enterprise content management ones directly from within Lotus Notes. So you can see on the side shelf how I have access to all of my repository directories, including the FileNet one and the document that I uploaded earlier. And again, we also provide you capability for mail management and having Quicker be a repository for documents. For example, in this attachment, you can, in this note here, you can see that I have multiple attachments and I have the option now of moving those attachments out of my mail file and into the Quicker repository. IBM Lotus Quicker combined with IBM FileNet and IBM Content Manager unlocks worldwide enterprise content to be accessible across the organization from everyday business applications, such as email, office documents, etc. It makes advanced ECM services such as records management and business process workflow more accessible to end users and helps organizations achieve agility and innovation through collaborative tools without sacrificing the management and business controls of a powerful ECM system.